Hi friends, welcome back to Frosty Eye Candy. Today we're going big on a 20 inch cradle. Today we're going to be using our colour to go as our pillow paint. This one actually is a really fun colour, it's called Fun Fuchsia. And then our colours today are going to be Perlex Solar Gold. From the dollar store, Deco Art Metallics, this is Peacock Pearl. And then one of my favourite little companies, TLP, this little piggy. This one is Twinkle, the Interference Blue Violet. And then next we have Deco Art Acrylic Series. This one is Fun Fuchsia, uh, again from the dollar store. Something it doesn't say on the label is that it reacts under UV light, which is great. And then next we have one of my favourites, Liquitex Fluorescent Blue. And then last but not least, Another one of my favourites, Liquitex Prism Violet. Okay, and today our cell activator is going to be Prussian Blue, these Amsterdam standard acrylics. Uh, and we're using the Shelley Art recipe, uh, the Australian Floetol recipe, which is four parts Floetol to one part paint. Okay, so that's enough of me talking already. Uh, let's get the camera pointing down and let's get painting. Okay, so this is our pillow down, guys. Let's put the uh, first pigment down, which is going to be the uh, Jacquard Perlex Solar Gold. And remember, we can sh stop short of the edges of the canvas because when we spin it, they are just going to just going to leave us. Okay, that's the Jacquard Solar Gold. Next, it's going to be the Deco Art Peacock Pearl. Now, my one of one of my many favourites, Twinkle by uh, this little piggy. And I say every time, but if you want to know where you can get your hands on some pigs, please go to fluid-art.co and you can order all the little piggies you like. I wish I could order more. Okay, next we're putting down the Fun Fuchsia by uh, Deco Art. Now it's the turn of the Liquitex Fluorescent Blue. And then last but not least, the Liquitex Prism Violet. And if you want to know about my colours and the pouring medium. I suggest you watch my first video. I just noticed a couple of little bubbles in the pillow and a couple of bubbles in my colours. I just like to quickly torch them out. Okay, now for the fun stuff. They're swiping with the Prussian blue. Okay then, so I'm going to just do a regular straight swipe just off the edge of the canvas, okay? Worked quite nicely. Just 
give the cell activator a little blow in the middle to break it up a bit. And let's carry on swiping. I particularly like these colours together, they work very, very well. I try to keep quiet while I'm actually working because I'm sure you don't want to hear just monotonous talking and I'm not one of those people that like the sound of my own voice. Okay, second to last swipe guys. I also think this is quite a fun one on this fun fuchsia background. It's very strong. <laughs> Yeah, I know I said second to last swipe, but I thought of these bits at the edge and how I would like them to be swiped and part of the whole piece. And here we go with the last swipe, guys. Mmm, great. I certainly like what that's doing. Okay, great. So, we'll uh, have a little close-up right now and see if I can do it decently with the uh, camera on. Here we go, guys. Okay, so now I'm going to take it over the spinning area and we're going to spin this baby. So here we go for the spin. Now for the spoon the other way. Hey, she's looking great. See how she moves. Okay, I think just a couple more spins, guys. Some great cell action there. One last spin, I feel. Just one more. Well, she's looking pretty good. We'll finish up with a uh, close-up. And don't forget to like and subscribe, leave a comment. And uh, as always, happy pouring.
So here's the close up. I'm going to try and do this as gently as I can, or as smoothly as I can. And you have some beautiful cells here, as you can see. And here's the whole piece. Again, thank you. Please like and subscribe. Happy pouring.